got right now. I hear that Michael Jackson is about to break it on down in South Auckland, <laughs> Manurewa. B, if you can hear me, girl, please get a photo of him, get an autograph of him, and just say, man, I'm a big, I'm a big fan of <laughs> MJ. Oh. Yeah, Ronnie, don't worry, I've got some autographs. Unfortunately, I can't get a selfie because the old camera fell in the puddle, but it's all good because I have the man right here. Close to Michael Jackson, this here is Ethan Sharnett. Can we all give him a round of applause, people? Now, this dude is pretty impressive because Ethan, not only a Michael Jackson impersonator, but an overall triple threat superstar. Uh, now, Ethan has just come back from LA where he was in the world champs for dancing. So basically like a talent show Olympics. And uh, Ethan, buddy, can you just hold up what you brought back home? Oh yeah, look at that. Basically scooped up all the medals over there. Uh, now, Ethan, welcome to the show and thank, thank you for coming in um, the we like with the weather like this. Uh, something I wanted to ask you is like, how was it going over to LA and competing on the world stage? Well, the, there was a lot of sun. It was boiling hot. Like, it was different so from today. Different, yeah. <laughs> and um, it was it was nice to compete and meet a lot of people. There was like 50 different countries there. Ooh. So, um, yeah, we New Zealand was celebrating their 10th year going to the event. So it was a amazing experience to be there and meet everybody that was new there. Yeah, and um, something that's really interesting about Ethan is that he didn't go to any dance schools or anything like that. He is self-taught. So, like, how did you get to the point where you were, like, you know, world-class teaching yourself? Well, when I was little, I used to... My dad would take me to his friend's house and while they would talk, they would just watch Michael Jackson. And as, as a child, as, like, a little two-year-old baby, I'd scream and shout for Michael Jackson. <laughs> and then I'll just reenact his moves. And ever since then, I've been watching this, um, the movies of Michael Jackson yep. over and over nice. to learn more. And I'm still learning today. That's so cool. And you come from a very talented family. Yeah. My dad used to dance when he was a teenager. And yep. my brother, me and my brother used to enter talent shows. And nice. now, he's, now he's not he's not in dance anymore, but he's he's an amazing dancer. Yeah. And so, what would be the dream? Because you are um, a triple threat. Uh, you do acting, you do some dancing and singing. So, what's the dream for you? I would like to open a dance school to help anybody who wants to dance to help them to do what they want to do and find out what, where they want to dance and what type of style and help them and also perform around the world. That's and amazing and I bet that we will all see Ethan on the world stage doing his thing, opening up a performance art centre. So can we all please give a big round of applause for Ethan. Thank you buddy. What now? What now? Sundays. From 8 a.m. On 2.